hi lovelies how are you doing welcome back to my channel my name is lola if you're new here so because we work at softcom many of us always make jokes about wanting to live soft life <laughs> and so i thought let me ask some of my colleagues get them to talk about what soft life is because i feel like you know the old love for soft life and the old craze for soft life that's not really the life that many people are living many people are living and struggling to make ends meet and to just you know eat and survive also i feel like we've really built soft life into something where it seems very unattainable vacations and some things meanwhile soft life can mean as little as whatever gives you joy from your hard life <laughs> i press that <laughs> i'm a product designer yeah, um, starting to be a front-end developer possibly move up to a full stack developer most of everything i do is tied around working sales speaking to customers which is like a daily life thing right um mostly behind the screen chasing my dreams basically and uh, also working so so because of my type of person right i'm not always online but majorly to sell comedy check up on my friends and see what's happening around the world watching movies for me is a hobby <laughs> biography autobiography and less of reality i like to read i like to read a lot i complain about not having time to do things but when i have that time is that i'm reading i'm watching cartoon or i'm on tiktok that's it and i cook i like to cook in my free time when i'm not designing i also create content on youtube uh, and my various social media pages i'm a, I, I like fitness so i like i like to exercise i also like to watch movies um, i like to sleep i love that sleeping as an activity <laughs> Almost an addiction, I think, is I watch YouTube reactions, reactions to music and reactions to anime. Always, always listen to music. Always listen to music. I used to like to play football as well, but I don't play as much football anymore. Game more like physical. Yes, physically now. Why are you looking at me like that? What are you looking at me? I'm asking. I'm a baller now. I'm not like a baller. Some people say that I look like Neymar Jr. Do you know? Okay, do you know okay. Neymar? <laughs> Never junior. Never junior is not that is making enough money to live soft life. To live soft life. Uh, that guy can price Nigeria. Soft life. <sighs> um, well, soft life is like having money to do basically anything you want. So, you like, you know, you want to go out and, you know, you don't feel like eating at home and then you just feel like, you know, going to one of these expensive restaurants just to treat yourself. At any time, you can just decide to go apply for leave and go for a vacation. Just have some nice vacations, cool life, no stress. Um, uh, hmm. <laughs> ah, I'm fantasizing, that's why I cannot continue talking. But soft life is dope. I really don't know what people call soft life. But for me, if I'm able to go out more, right? When I mean go out, hang out with friends. Um, again, we're all working to, maybe some of us are working to have enough money to go out, right? But, I mean, to be able to go out more, to be able to have more leisure time, to catch up with whatever it is, movies, anything. I just want to think, I just want to, I just want to enjoy. For me to not, in an hour, I have to think of work, whether it's personal work or, you know, corporate work. To enjoy life to some extent. Soft life is, you just want something and you can get it. You just want to go out and chill and, you know, your people are there and you can have all the fun you want to have with them. Sometimes I also do like solo, solo enjoyment, so that one's said I really like my life to be quite peaceful, although I'm not much of a party person. So was, that's why I said peaceful, but I also love to attend some parties, you know, feel that vibe, catch that cruise that I see other people catching, just at least losing up a bit. Sometimes do crazy things, safe. It's fun now, fun. Now money be cocoa now, that's what Mr. Izzy said. I would really like to, to start making money like <laughs> i do like going out but i hardly go out because it's always stress when you think about how to like the planning of going out <laughs> i don't know how to go out i'm trying to work on it so i don't know how to have this soft life quote and unquote that people will say go out party i don't drink so i don't know how to do that so uh yeah i just do what i can to have the soft life while i work I don't know my kind of person. Maybe something just needs to drag me. <laughs> but right now, mentally, it's a bit stressful. So I'm planning to get an AC because I don't have AC. But like, you know, I just want to make sure this house is as comfortable as it should be for me, no matter how much like I'm earning. 
I mean, people don't count it as like, I know it's not luxury, but like, I mean, I still want to feel comfortable wherever I am. I mean, like, where I walk, I, I'm not, I don't use normal chair. Like, I got like the chair that will be comfortable when I walk and the table that will be comfortable when I walk. And you know, those small, small little, little things that you just get just to be comfortable. Maybe I just need to set out time and maybe a budget to have fun, but I don't know. I think about it sometimes and I'm like, you know what, I'd rather just chase my dreams and blow at once and then I'll flex. Maybe getting more into the social community because although I said um, I see most of the soft life online, I tend not to actually go spend much time on social media. So if I'm with my phone, it's either I'm playing a game or I'm watching a movie. Most of the time, it's always a movie. So you tend to make no changes, Shadow. <laughs> <laughs> you guys only talk about No, them. actually, I would love to meet people, but I'll actually, you know, have this kind of network. idea on, yes, network of friends or something. One, one of my friends. Um, she always makes me do uh, really interesting things. She's like my good vibes friend. <sighs> Saying it like that kind of sounds somehow, but no, we're really cool. And you know, she's the one that kind of prompts me to do some real crazy stuff. The first time I was in a building in Lagos and there were more Europeans than I've ever seen. Do you, do you get like, there were so much, I think the percentage was maybe 40, 60. It was that mad. And they can't dance, let's keep it the book. So terrible dancing. And so it made me really comfortable to also dance my terrible dance. My friends would plan an outing and from it, they're, they're already like, Ronke is not going to come. But I'm like, oh my God, that's so painful. And eventually I actually will not come. Maybe I actually sincerely plan to be there, but something just happened. Mm -hmm. I know that I missed out because of a decision I made. It's better for me to manage than, oh my God, my friends are already moving on without me. You need to be deliberate about whatever you want to do. This year, January, I went for a vacation in a private island. You see Lagos, but it's still like private. <laughs> I'm, I'm practicing the soft life and uh, at the end of this year I plan to like you know go outside Nigeria maybe to Ghana or something. So. As much as I would love to say I have work-life balance I would say it has been not balanced. Right now what I'm basically doing is I'm trying to find the comfort and the enjoyment even in work so it doesn't seem like I'm always working. As much as people want to succeed they should also care for themselves enough to have fun. You know, look your head, no go by heat. You get what I'm saying? Nigeria is tough. I know we're currently at a critical time. Everyone's, um, without getting too political, looking forward to what happens next year. Whatever you do, try to make sure that you are living your best life. Even if you are kind of person that, maybe you're like me, you work two for seven, your head is always calculating what to do next. Um, Make sure you do something that you enjoy. Make sure that you don't lose touch on reality, on your friends, on people that matter. Because at the end of it all, when you are mentally stressed, when you are bodily stressed, those are the people that will be there for you, not your work. So find time to make the balance. If you are like me, I think you really need a soft life. Like you need it very bad. <laughs> With glasses or without glasses? Eh? Very first thing I wanted to be when I was young was I wanted to be a power ranger. <laughs> I just don't know how to pose for pictures. I, I get tired. Just spotlight me. Nobody will believe you. Because something that my mom always says is like, don't work, 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 work. Mm -hmm. and then Without having anything to show with it. Yeah. You will die and next of you will spend your money on iPhone. <laughs> <laughs> I really did it. I feel, like, I feel like you're getting you're putting a lot of like pressure to like succeed and do certain things that you want to do. And so you're worrying a lot about like the future. And so like you're finding it very difficult to relax. Yes, actually. I find it very difficult to relax. You no, know, just put more everything is just Walk, walk, let's see that bag, let's get that money. No, but I want Murphy. Murphy is really lives. What's Murphy? Murphy. You don't know Murphy? Uh, you're an up. <laughs> <laughs> What's Murphy? You don't know Murphy.
You don't know maybe. Uh, Nigeria is not happening to you. Nigeria is not happening to you. What do you mean? What? Now I need to leave. I've been here for 100 years. Bye. <laughs>